Good morning Aquarius, my name's Clive, you're watching Emery's Tarot. I bid you a very great welcome to this reading. Okay, everybody's welcome, new viewers, cross watchers, everybody. Okay, it's my honour to read for you. So without further ado, let's get into this. The only message I have is, you know, the energies do ebb to and fro. So please just take it out, resonates, and leave the rest. Here we go. This is for the sign of Aquarius. What messages does the universe has for the sign of Aquarius? One more shuffle here. Like this. Universe, spirits, guides, messages. Very much appreciated for the sign of Aquarius. Straight off the bat, Empress. Great card to come out with. Okay. I'm kind of getting here that new feelings. Healing is taking place mainly within yourself. You're coming back into your power, Aquarius. All right. There's a new perspective developing. Okay. I'm getting here for some of you that there is somebody new. All right. For the majority of you, there is genuine feelings there for somebody. <clears throat> I'm getting that these are... <clears throat> reciprocated but hidden mm. there seems to be some kind of fear of you know somebody here feels very vulnerable about exposing their true feelings towards you There could well be a pregnancy here. Congratulations on that one. Or a newborn. And, you know, there's a lot of changes there. For one or two of you, I'm getting childhood issues unresolved. And what I mean by issues is not necessarily bad issues, but there's just issues there, you know, perhaps different beliefs from your parents or parent. Okay. But there is, it, what I'm getting Aquarius is, you know, in general terms, a lot of people care for you, okay? You are very impressionative now. People take notice of you. They may not tell you, but they are doing. Okay. What I'm also getting is that you could be dealing with somebody who is married. They may be separated, but, you know, that energy is still there. Okay, a much, what I'm getting is for a lot of you, you're a much more realistic approach to this situation. What's the challenge? Mm, the challenge is a lot of stress. <laughs> Ouch. Mm. In true Aquarius form, you're second guessing, trying to figure out every single scenario. Okay. There is forgiveness involved in this scenario as well. I'm getting there was a lot of complications in the past. I'm getting there was a lot of anxiety. This person didn't re, you know, reciprocate your feelings. All right, you tried and you tried. And I'm kind of getting a lot of you are still trying. The kind of guidance here... I'm getting is let go don't try so hard okay I'm getting that this will work itself out I'm getting here that some of you are trying too hard all right what's influenced this yeah a long-standing struggle between you and somebody Okay, but I'm, I'm getting here for one or two of you. 
there's a reconnection on a different level. Like I say, there's new feelings, there's healing going on between you two. Whether there's communication or not, you know, Aquarius, and you think there's nothing happening, all right? But, you know, all your connections are coming to the fore now in feelings and in the practical sense as well, you know, parents, family, are all coming to the fore. You are in kind of like this moon energy. There's, there's, a, there's a fear of stepping out of your comfort zone. Okay, your intuition is very, very strong. There's, there's definitely somebody here. That, I'm not getting this is on your side. I'm getting it's on the person you're dealing with. They, they, f they feel very vulnerable in talking about their feelings towards you they do definitely feel have a deep deep connection with you but they're afraid to show it well card in the past yeah this person was perhaps married okay still is and you, you you're trying to figure out every kind of scenario a way forward but you keep coming back to the same old point, you know, unless this person makes any positive moves, you don't really see how it can work out. But your efforts in the past are now starting to give you emotional and spiritual growth. You, you are starting to view this with an entirely different perspective. And I'm kind of getting you wish for these changes and they are occurring, but within you. So, you know, basically, Aquarius, you're getting very, very strong now towards this situation, towards this person. But, you know, you started a new life cycle, okay, in the past, and it will bring you full circle, but with a very, very different attitude and, and many new opportunities, all right? But this particular connection, you know, that you're in, or at least spiritually and emotionally, okay, it, it has the potential to go long lasting. I'm kind of getting it's going to deepen in some way. All right. Whether they're married or not, whether you're married or not, but it's going to take an awful lot of strength, integrity, continuity, and drive. Okay. This person, even if there isn't any communication at the moment, I'm kind of getting they soon will communicate. All right, which will bring an end to a very, very long period of, you know, pain. There, there was a relationship here in the past that has healed very painfully. And uh, perhaps the person you're dealing with needed to heal themselves sufficiently and build up the courage to put themselves forward and follow their true feelings their true yeah their true passion they are definitely attracted to you aquarius okay near future yeah a sudden turnaround this could come in the form of an invite to go see them spend a holiday with them but there is some definite changes and i'm kind of getting that you coming together in the physical sense, okay, in the materialistic world, this energy has all been gaining momentum. And even if there's been silence on getting a coming back together, all right, they want you. They do want you, Aquarius, in their life at some level. But I'm not picking up total commitment, but I'm picking up genuine feelings here. There is a very good chance if you choose, you can work this out. But as I say, this is a general reading. It will not apply to all of you. Some of you will say, well, I'm never going to have anything to do with this person again. So that's what I mean by, you know, this is a general, take it out, it resonates. Some of you may want this person and let them back in. Some of you may not. But there is a definite change of perspective here. Okay. Where it wasn't possible for you two to come back together in the past, it is now there is a very, very strong possibility. Your energy, Aquarius.
patience. <laughs> Some of you are not, but <laughs> patience is the key. And being very, very truthful and honest, here you are. I'm kind of getting a lot of you have decided not to hide your true self. You're certainly plucking up the courage to say exactly what you believe, exactly what you want. But if need be, you're in a position to cut this person loose. I'm kind of getting a lot of you are tired of waiting. Their energy. Yeah, they have split loyalties. Uh, I'm kind of getting this person is perhaps a parent. There's, there's definitely family, family issues there on their side. Okay, there is on your side, as I said, but you know for different reasons. But there's there's a lot of intense emotions here, and it doesn't deter the fact that this person wants to be with you. But it's kind of on their on their terms the question is what are you willing to compromise what are you willing to you know take to the table how much of yourself are you willing to put into this aquarius you still have the power you know your own true worth you know you could also be dealing with like i say family okay but there's, there's relative pasts here that are affecting this union. The energy between you. Yeah, one of regret. But to a degree, both of you have been avoiding and seeing the situation through kind of rose-tinted glasses. I'm getting here making promises, not you, but... Not you alone, sorry, but both of you have been kind of making promises to yourselves. Okay, and the way this should go forward, but it, it was with unrealistic expectations and it led to regret. Decisions here made led to regret. You do have the power to make a more, a better decision with better judgment now, simply because your energy is changing and you're, you know, viewing this with a much more realistic expectation in the past you were perhaps dealing with some very very strong opinions and a refusal to change opinions okay somebody here was sticking to their guns okay and again that led to regret but there was a there was a very painful ending here in the past for you Aquarius and you know there's been a there's been a lot of avoidance I'm kind of getting at the moment both of you are waiting for each other there's a bit of pride here. Mm. There's also jealousy and resentment. It's it's keeping you two apart at the moment. It could well be that the person you're dealing with is not married, but there's a parental influence. Let's get one more card. Well, there is a fresh start. There is communication. I'm kind of getting that third party influence will always be there, but with a different perspective and a much more realis realistic approach and forgiveness, perhaps you can make this work. There is a way forward, but it does involve compromises on both sides. I'm going to leave it there, Aquarius. Thank you very much for watching.